Okay, this is what, take four now on this game? Apparently, if I plug in my headphones, for some odd reason, it refuses to pick up the audio. If I do it for that, then it's fine. Anyway, uh, let's get uh, Isaac a new sword. Sell the old battle axe. Let's get a game ticket. Sell the game ticket. Bring some extra coins. And get the hell out of here. Let's go down here. That. Yeah, this is the first, the fourth time I'm recording this, and actually, and up there is Jupiter, Jupiter Duty. Whoops. There's nothing to move. McCoy's hidden warehouse. Do not enter. <laughs> anyway, we can go over there because there's a statue of the of McCoy's wife. In a way, yes, that's his wife, and dear God, is she a boy? Anyway, if we want to get that genie, we have to go over here. Actually, I'm going to have to uh, look up the guide actually later on where all the genies are. Some of them are actually even across the world now. And you have to go in a certain area in order to find them, and then they will find you, and if they run away, it is very annoying. Because you have to go into a city and then. Oh, redo it! Of course, the easiest way to just save and just reload the game if you fail. Good save states in my case. Uh, anyway, we have now obtained a. Now obtained Gust for, for Ivan. Okay, now, um, as I've already said in my last recording, which didn't get through, uh, which I'm still upset of, over, there are two things you can do. You can go to Kolima after you see McCoy up in this mansion. Or, well, you can do it the hard way. Whoopsie! You can do this game the hard way if you know, if you played this before, because if you've know, you played this before, then you know what you're going to have to do. After you go to Kolima, you can skip going to Kolima the first time uh, and just go straight to uh, Emil up, up north. Also, uh, when I was training, I took the time to train a little in this area, in the cave. Because there are enemies in here that. Oh, yeah, that happened. Uh, Herp the derp! Rope! There we go. In Golden Sun Dark Dawn, you, your character gets in standard, which is good. It's annoying to have to s constantly switch around uh, Ginny in order to get growth. Doink. Okay, we are in Billabing Cave. And up here, there is an elven right here. Now, the elven right here is a lot better than the broadsword that you bought, so technically the broadsword was a waste of your money. Also, keep this in mind. That is for a secret. Ugh, ghouls. Ah! Cannibal thing. Yeah, yeah, sometimes it has no effect. We can hit these guys three times, though. Purple flesh. <laughs> yeah, you have to hit these guys three times, and hopefully you not miss. Stumble this. Bye-bye. Doing bye bye. Level 11 Squire, woohoo! Uh, also, these enemies drop a lot more money than they do outside. Uh, this is probably because you. This thing is skipping a, a huge part of the storyline, oh god, ooze! Now, ooze are pretty fun. Why? Because they're easy to level up with. And get some money. If you're lucky, they can split up into multiples. They give you a whole lot of it age experience. Let's say it may be. This one refused to do so. So I guess 60 uh, experience per ooze. So yeah, you can imagine it's going to give you a lot of experience if we get a lot of them. And here we get to see the coal! Ah! Alright, three ghouls. Also another thing I'd like to point out. Uh what's it pointing out again? Oh yeah. Um, in order to get the stuff I needed, I can't get that yet. 
to get the money I needed. Come on. Level 11 good! Woohoo! Some of you might have already noticed, but I sold all my herbs. Why did I sell all my herbs? The Golden Sun is one of the few games where you actually don't need healing items because your PP regenerates over time as you walk. Good for you, just... The insect doesn't really die that off that, that much. It's strange, but it doesn't die that much. Three of them, huh? Three, four. Do you know that if you come this way before you go to Kolima, to the south, you may get your ass kicked because these enemies are tough. Goddamn baller. If you don't get specials, these take more than free hits. Welcome to Emil! Are you new in Emil? Yes, I'm new. There's a bad cold going on, try not to catch. Yep. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, I got a lucky medal. <laughs> okay, now there'll be a snowman up here, and we need that to get in that cave over there in the waterfall. Well, technically it's not really a waterfall. On a side note, this area is completely inaccessible and going some dark dog! God damn it, his eyes! Ah! Wee 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 wee! Hello there! And this is the second part of Marginny. You should have back there! Wee! Wee! And now we are going to get. Get the treasure chest up here. Because up here is a treasure chest with a very good healing item. A vial. A vial are very, very important because they replenish 500 HP. Later on in the game, they're going to be extremely useful. Ugh. I usually don't sell. Uh, that. Don't keep healing items with me, but. This is one of those items I might actually keep. Well, I'm sick, but I can get you whatever you need. Welcome, we have just the gear you need. I want what? I have to sell my rosary. I can't, it's 700. Because the armor and weapon shop is closed. Both the people who work there are definitely sick. So, yeah. Ugh, get out of my way, kid. Whatever. Do not forget to pick up this. I'm gonna need it. Okay, I'm gonna get Mia. You just hanged up, Grandpa. Ah! Why do I keep pressing that button? Uh, there's nothing to be uh, happy. Been obvious. Just the fact that she has a mock shot means that she's important. Push yourself too hard. Thank you, Mia. Cough. What bed? There's only one bed in this house. Huh? Who are you? Can I help you? Yes, it was. You- Bye, Mia. Okay, our next stop is the first lighthouse. This be the Mercury Lighthouse. Fountain of Healing, Water of Hermes, it brings rejuvenation to all that lives. Remember that for later, you're gonna need that. Hey, Mia! Somebody is here. You already said that. Yeah, I hear. <laughs> what the 
biggie. Yoink! Yeah. Ply is probably the only heal- Yeah, it's much like the other fail. Anyway, Ply is the only healing magic that can actually be used outside of battle for uh, something other than healing. In the Mercury Lighthouse is actually used also to solve certain puzzles. Uh, why did I jump? There's a lizard man blocking the way. Okay, now if you beat this guy with the, uh, I'm mistaken, it's hard. Two, whoopsie. Grab, and you, use forge. Actually, why is. Ah, oh, forge. Ah, oh, forge is still set to get. Isa, why did I forget to do that again? And yoink! Water blessing? Da! Ah! I think I can do that. Well, let's see if I can actually get this summon off. Or. You die. Da! Ah! Oh, level 11 wins here. Cool, I guess I can. They get the show of Kieran. Just sad. Kieran is pretty cool. Okay, fever. Go to Garrett. He who honors the hearth of the goddess shall stand at the center of all, like a swan in the center of a rippling pond. <laughs> yeah, that's also important for a puzzle later. Uh, that, actually, it's not really a puzzle, it's just a gimmick of this lighthouse. Most of these lighthouses have a gimmick. Oh, the power's up again, what am I going to do? I'm going to do this! Well, I'm going to do it. Yoink! You've saved me again, haven't you? Me, I joined your party! Woohoo! This entire game, it's just. Yeah. Just certain air. Anyway. Here be. Our portable side crystal. Another item I rarely ever use. You see, I've never actually used them in the uh, in any of the games. What the hell? Oh. What the... Oh, God. Uh, anyway, we have to go this way. Sorry, I was distracted there for a little bit. Ah! Don't... God. So, whatever. I was going to! Shut up! Yeah. Don't be the only one that can the first one to, uh, that I encountered that he used <laughs> oh, and then Here's Kitten! Woo! 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 Of course this is a lot more epic in the in the DS version of the game. <laughs> 
Deixa eu pegar o bicho. Doink. Okay, now we're not going to get a, uh, what's it called? Oh yeah, we're not going to get a, um, Earth Jenny and, um, uh, Earth, no, Venus Jenny or a, uh, Jupiter Jenny until we go to Kalima. We are going to get a, uh, <sighs> I keep trading the planets, a Mercury, uh, Jenny. If I can remember what the, behind which waterfall it is, anyway. This is a very easy puzzle if you haven't freaking it out already. In you go. Open the door. Let me down. Let me up. Through. And let me down! Uh, he wanders the heart of the gods, just stand in the center of all, like a swan in the center of a broken pond. Now what are we supposed to do here? Whoopsie! We use flying! Since this, uh, this place is based around the Mercury clan, yeah, we're going to be needing ply a lot. I see a lot of these lighthouses, they're all going to be based around the element that uh, they represent, so yeah, you get the point. Yeah, anyway, that activates the, the gimmick, and now we can jump on water! You get free halos, you get free jumps on the water, if you don't succeed, you drown. Nah, you restarted the spot the spot you were before you drowned. Anyway, I am going to leave the lighthouse, go outside, and I'm going to train for a little bit. Hopefully the sound is going to not screw me over again. Ah. Uh, anyway, I'm going to train until I'm at least level 15 with everybody. Uh, why? Because the boss in the original GBA version totally kicked my ass and killed Garrett off. And I did not have a water of life on me. Actually, that reminds me, I should probably put those on Isak. Oh well. Here's hoping the sound doesn't screw up. <sighs> Later!